Okay, this is going to be a quick video, quick rock round startup, uh, revving of a 1980 Lada 2101. It's going to be for sale on Facebook for around $7,000. Um, give it a quick cold start, then I'll, let, then I'll let it warm up for a few minutes because it's a maybe 40 degrees out right now so it's a little chilly gonna take a sec then I'll pull it out let it idle give it a couple revs and go from there a quick walk around so I'll be right back okay it's gonna be a cold start a manual choke turn the key so we on the left And see, lights pop on. The one on the left is the e brake, and that will stay on and flash until the e brake goes off. Choke is on. A couple pumps. See what it does. Instantaneous. Choke down a little bit. Okay. I will let it warm up, and then I'll be right back. Okay, I'm gonna pull it out. It's been only only been running for about a minute and a half, maybe two. So it's still warming up, but should be good enough to at least pull it out. So we'll do that real quick. Okay, I just finished pulling it out. As you can see, it's still pretty cold, but I turned the choke all the way off. Normally, it'd be just under half, like right about there when it's fully warmed up, so it's still got a ways to go. So, it's not running perfectly smooth yet, but it smooths out when it's nice and warm. Uh, give you a quick walk around. You can see, see the light's still flashing, it'll pull the e brake off. It goes away, so it's got no dash, no dash lights of any kind on. Can turn the lights on, and I'll take you for a quick walk around. There's the there's the driver's seat. That's just a little Bluetooth speaker I use for my phone. See how clean it is. A little rag I use to clean it, clean up the windows and stuff. The back a little sunshade. You can see the interior is nice. Got a couple dents. You can see one right here. A couple scratches, but pretty much no rust. It's got a bubble there. A very tiny one. A little bit of surface there, but that's it. Underneath is nice and clean. You can see, even when it's still this cold, it still runs. It's running pretty good already. It's got its issues, like any old car, but the light's on. It's kind of hard to see because it's still very light out, but... Turn, let me pop the hood real quick. Right there. But it's got a small exhaust leak and that right there, that spot right there. I have a gasket for it though. Just haven't put it in yet. And here's what it is. Another little paint spot right there. So I'm just pretty dirty because I live on a dirt road, but 
give it a couple of revs, even though it's still cold. Revs with no issue, it's still not even out of that, not even close to being warmed up yet. Close the hood. Say so take it down the driveway real quick. It's gonna be hard to do this one-handed, but let's give it a go and see what happens. He breaks off, put it in the first. It does have a five-speed swapped into it, but I also still have the four-speed. Start back up when I get back home. Okay, I just pulled back in. It's a little bit warmer now. You can see it. it smooths out pretty good. It does have two inch lowering springs. New lower control arms and bushings. It, um, these are Fiat wheels. I can show you real quick all the extra parts that I still have for it. Some maintenance stuff, some just extras, some stuff, some of the stuff I took off. Let's see here. Oil belts, oil filter. Got a new blower motor, even though it doesn't need it. Uh, electronic ignition conversion. Here are the original tires and wheels. And the original rim or uh, hubcaps floating right there. It's the original four speed right there. And I didn't pop the trunk, but it's got the original jack, hand crank, tool kit, tire puncture kit. What the? Shut her off, get the key. I don't, know if the, I don't know if the keys are original, but they have Hungarian on them or Russian or something. I'm not entirely sure. Pop the trunk real quick. Got a little road safety thing. Hand crank. It's got a toolkit there and there. Those are some extra fuses. A uh, med kit. Bunch of paperwork, the original owner's manual. Uh, that's a gas tank and the original spare. Let's get in here. This is a little light bulb kit. I don't know if it's original, but it has a bunch of extra bulbs for the car. I also have a bunch of a uh, package of interior bulbs for it. Left the lights on. Still can't really see them. Nice Hungarian or Russian license plate. Let's Stop the key. Show you that even the radio works. Pull this up. understood by governments that are recognized as governments even if they are there. Yes. That, that is exactly correct. But 
Blower motor still works. The heat works. Um, I don't know. It's got 52,000 kilometers. So like n nothing in miles. And the lights off. Yeah, it's, it's like I said, it's for sale. 7,000 ish. And slightly flexible. But uh, yep. Yeah. So let me let me know if you're interested.